from the footballgameplan.com where football makes sense. I'm Emory Hunt, the czar of the playbook, bring you our Division II National Championship Game of the Week preview between the Winston-Salem State Rams and the Valdosta State Vulcans. Now let's take a look at some keys to victory for both teams, starting with Winston-Salem State. When you look at Winston-Salem in this ball game, you look at the outstanding ground game that they possess with Maurice Lewis and Bryce Sherman. Those guys can really get it done. And I think that's how the Rams are going to have to move the football at first versus Valdosta State. They can't just rely on the pass because Valdosta State has some outstanding secondary play. So the running game, first and foremost for the Rams in order for them to have a chance. That way you can get Cameron Smith rolling in the passing game. Defensively, the Rams are facing an explosive offense in Valdosta State. Now, you look at their defense. They're built with their linebackers. They do a great job of playing downhill. How well can they cover the short and intermediate passing game? That's going to be the biggest question because we know right now they're going to have to win that battle up front versus the Blazers. If they can't do that, then they could, they're going to have a rough day versus Valdosta State and their outstanding quarterback, Caden Cochran. Now let's move over to the Blazers in this ball game, and I'm sorry, not the Vulcans, the Blazers, wanted to correct myself, but you look at quarterback Caden Cochran, 25 touchdowns, 8 interceptions, the guy is getting it done, and what he does well is his athleticism buys time in the passing game, but also opens things up for the running backs, which is why two tailbacks have over 1,000 yards for the Blazers, and when you look at their offensive line, rarely do you see a group of guys up front that can either be road graders and excellent pass protectors. That's why this is an explosive offense, and that's why they have a great quarterback in keeping him clean. This offensive line, only the line of scrimmage, will be a key component of this ball game. Defensively, I look at the Blazers' secondary. They're going to have to match up with the outstanding wide receivers, Massey and Butler of Winston-Salem State. Now, the Blazers do have an outstanding cornerback in Lance Holder. This guy is always around the football, leads the team in interceptions, and he's going to do a great job of playing the ball once it's in the air. When you look at their second level, once again, the linebacking core is very strong on this ball club. They get a lot of sacks coming from the second level. If they're going to have success, they're going to need that defensive line to get pushed instead of pressure, collapse the pocket, so that way those linebackers can have free reign to the football. I like Winston-Salem State in this ball game. When you talk about a team that's been well-balanced from the start of the season throughout the playoffs, this team has the look, and they've had that look since the beginning of the season. I love the balance that they play with. They can run the football, have two outstanding tailbacks. They have two outstanding wide receivers and a quarterback that doesn't make mistakes. So look for the Winston-Salem State Rams to win this game, however, with their defense. I think the Ram defense will slow down just enough the Blazers' offense and walk away with the Division II National Championship.